Hello, the girls and the Frenchels. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And all today's menu, I'll be serving you Lunala GX, my favorite legendary from Sun and Moon. Yes, I bought Moon version. I don't care if Sogaleo's getting his day next expansion. It's all about Lunala. So, uh, more seriously, Lunala GX. I think it's just a sleeper for Pokemon. Well, I mean, it's, you know, not popular, not meta, but the stats, the abilities are top tier. These are things that you would see for, you know, from top tier Pokemons in the past. And, eh, it's there. It's definitely playable, the meta. So I thought I'd revisit it. Yeah, Lunala GX, we're gonna, you know, update you to what I think you know, is your best form right now. Using Mew to Necrozma Shining Mew. And most importantly, Max Potion. These cards, they're gonna make you work. Yeah, it's kind of like a Metagross, except psychic time. So, let's get started. I'm gonna explain to you how this Lunala GX works very, very quickly. And you're gonna see it in two. I thought the two best matches were my, uh, uh, my giveaway matches. So, Jay Dutton, we're gonna be playing the Sijuai GX twice here, which, yeah, those are good matches. Very, very awesome. Say that. So let us get started. Today's intro is my remix of Save Tonight by Eagle Eye Chair. All right, Lunala, let's go ahead and break you down now. First of all, you are a bat, which is awesome. Nighttime, better than like, you know, like a shining lion. Uh, fuck about the card. 250 hit points. You are a legendary Pokemon. Stage 2, highest evolution. You have the best hit points in the entire game. Good luck one-shotting it. Even Zorark GX cannot one-shot this without a choice man. So, oh, that's, that's just big hit points. Yeah, ability is top tier. You can move psychic energies wherever you want. Any Pokemon want, just switch him over. And this has always been extremely good in Pokemon because it's very compatible with Max Potion. Heal Pokemon completely back to full. Whenever you want, when Lunala's up. So you absolutely should use this. Along with tanky hit points, yeah, you will out-trade your opponent just if you want to fight with Lunala GX. Okay, so it's, this was a little tricky. Its attack is kind of expensive for four energy. Most Pokemon these days can do it for three, but four energy, she do get a bonus effect. They can't heal, which usually does nothing most of the time, but it's a two shot. And with the choice band, very sure it's a two shot. Finally, it's GX attack is also bad these days. You could knock out, you could just get a prize guard, which, you know, uh, just for three energies, and it can't be a GX Pokemon. Yeah, so, that really, this attack doesn't really get you anywhere. You're just gonna use it if you're stuck. You really want to use another Pokemon's GX, so this is the card. Moving on, what else? We have Mewtwo who is stuck in this little bottle here. He looks, you know, kind of weak, kind of vulnerable. I think someone said that in chat. So. Why do we have Mewtwo here? Well, for one, he's much faster. I'm gonna take a while to set you up. You're stage two. You, uh, you may be stuck in a two, but it's like, ah, it's okay. It's no worries. I'll just get out and fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So full burst. Here's what it does. The more psychic energies you have, the more damage it does. Starts up at 30. Every psychic energy is scales a lot more. If you built up lots of psychic energies, you can just move them all on, get a one shot with your full burst kind of risky putting all the energies on one Pokemon because if it goes down, you're in trouble. But hey, you can get a one-shot with this first attack. So, second attack, uh, two energy. Really? Super absorption, 60 damage. With a choice, man, that is 90 damage. And 90 almost. Two shots of the Mewtwo. So, but it does give you 30 healing. If that 30 healing maybe comes in useful, you probably still really want to using full burst. Okay, so finally it has a GX attack, which is a little bit above average. This is something you see, actually maybe even better than some stage 1 GX Pokemons. This is doing 200 damage right off the bat. And it pierces through any effect. So if they have some strange immunity like Nine Tails, you would not GX with Nine Tails. It's just, it's just gonna go through. That, this, this little text doesn't make that much of a difference. It's really for that big giant burst one shot that you get on Mewtwo on many Pokemons in the meta. It's very, very good. So, that is that. Mewtwo, you're just you know, a very good fast attacker. It also has a different weakness than Lunala, so you won't have to war deal with weakness. Somebody can fight and won't take double damage. Alright, finally, another GX attack that's good, Necrozma, Prism Black Ray GX. Same matter, three energy costs. 
you do 100 damage to all your enemies GX Pokemon. So they're all going to be wounded by 100 damage. Now, it's going to be very easy to KO them because you don't need that much left. Now, with Super Absorption, what a choice, man. You could just finish this off. This guy would only have 150 left. Oh, great. Now, another Lunala can finish it off. Basically, every GX Pokemon becomes a one-shot after the Black Ray GX. That's not all. You can also, if you're near the end of the game, you need two prize cards. This will get a one-shot. It discards all energies off it. But it does 60 per energy instead of 30. So when you're at the end, boom, 120 damage. Uh, no, one-shot KO anywhere with four energies. Three can get basic GXs, but four gets almost everything. Everything with that one shot. So Necrozma, you, yeah, you definitely belong in the psychic deck. Finally, last card we're gonna talk about is Mew. And it's like, yeah, of course I need Mew. I'm a little sick though, cause I'm uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm blue. I'm kind of cold right now. That's uh, legend. No, she's shiny. Legendary guidance. You search your deck for two energy cards and put it onto your Pokemon. So, oh, I didn't have enough space for Max Elixir. I don't really have a... Well, I do have basics. So I decided to go with the cheaper version where I can use this attack to get always guaranteed two energy cards, two more psychic energies that I can move around with Lunala. All right, so there's that. All right, anything else we have to mention? All right, big trainers, big trainers. I have Alter the Moon. This gives my psychic Pokemon's free retreat. Anytime they want, as long as they have a psychic energy. If they do not have a psychic energy, Lunala's fix it for you. It's like, what? You don't have an energy? Oh yeah, you can borrow it. It's fine. Move it anything you want. Move it anywhere you want. So, it's a nice combo with Lunala. So we do have a little bit... Actually, we have four or five retreat cards. Yeah! Might I want to do something about that, Donald? Oh well, yeah, probably another max potion. But that's for the end of the deck. So, review! We have... He gets me energies! In the meantime, I'm trying to set up Lunala so I can move my energies. When I can do that, I can use Max Potion to heal my Pokemon. Where's the damage coming from? Lunala as well as Mewtwo. Their attacks are pretty strong. And they, uh, Lunala's GX sucks, but his GX is awesome and his GX is awesome. There's a short abbreviated invasion version. Why don't you tell us early at the start? Maybe I should. All right, that is it. So the matches. We're going to take on the Sidious Zora arc. Yeah, okay, that is that. Here we go. Let's get started. Today's Twitch giveaway winner is Jay Dutton, who used the reward to uh, to be able to score a match. And I'm going to honor that. Here we go. Let us do this. Here we go. Mewtwo match. I'm going to send out the only card I can right now. Yep. Yep. I'm going to play my, my remix of this is Limit Break X Survivor of Dragon Ball Super. All right. Good game. Uh, good luck to you, Jay Dutton. All right. We're done. What's he's got? Zora Art, Berry Master. Of course. That's everywhere. Let me see. The number of cards. Ooh, Bridget. Best card to start with. It is not Lola Nine Tails 2, or maybe even Baby Nine Tails. Do we have something to deal with that? Yeah, I think we do. It's actually gonna get charged this up so we can one-shot my guys. Yeah, get Berry Master out. Alright, we can hit any Pokemon we want. Okay, the stadium. I I definitely can't end. I definitely can't end. This is too many draw supporters gone. You know, this is what it means by paying the price. One draw supporter, two draw supporters gone. It might not be open. It might be okay as well. Mew, Shining Mew, are you here? Yes, you are. You are here. So we need a float stone to get you about. All right, we're gonna end. We're gonna give him the extra card pull right now. All right, that is it. I cannot do any more, so I'll end my turn. We'll take the slow, the slow route up, but I'd be okay. So, are these babies or are these the big ones? I think this won the Poker Beach tournament not so long ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so Barry Master, a little scared of this guy. Banana Master, high five, Banana Master. It's like you know what? Me and Barry Masters, we can be friends. We can work together together for a uh, for for a good end. Yeah. This guy gets draws when you have low cards, and usually they, they, they go against each other, you know, because you get more cards in your hand. Yeah, Barry Master's like, oh, well, you know, my trainer, I, my trainer's got plenty of cards in his hand. 
Well, who are you? You just give them one. They're, they're, they're like starving. So energy goes this time. Uh, it goes on to the lower nine tails. Okay, so and I really needed that. So but I'm gonna lose this Mew, but I'll probably be benefit from this. All right, so okay, energy and max potion. I see. I kind of need everything there, but it's okay. Ultra Ball. We're gonna see which nine tails this is. Uh, can we go around this? Kinda yes. Kinda yes. He threw away the stadium. We really want as many GX to show up as possible, so I can use the grass blade. It is Baby Alola Nine Tails. Alrighty then. I could technically GX that, but I don't really don't want to do that. Okay. Let me see how many GXs are present. It is my turn again. Good. And he allowed me to use the free retreats here, so I'm gonna definitely take advantage of that. Now we need a recipient of we need a recipient of these cards. Okay, Lunala, I know I have plenty of you. I'm gonna regret not having a max potion. I can recycle these back. They can recyclable. We'll get them back. The card I'm afraid of, right? I think Mewtwo needs to come out. Or we could just open up with a GX. It's gonna be a slow Lunala, but that's okay. Throw them out here. Throw this right here. Unfortunately, I have to end. So that's a <sighs> end. You're so you're such a traitor, man. You're a traitor! I think I already played that energy, so that's okay. At this point, we gotta get you Evolve! We've got to get you Evolve. You're taking way too long to get out. And of course, I can't throw these too many energies. Ultra Ball is so painful, isn't it? Oh my gosh, is this the only Cosmog? Hope oh, nobody tell him that, okay? Nobody tell him this is my only Cosmog. There's only one Cosmog here. There are two prized up Cosmog. Legendary Guidance! Yeah, take my energies. Who comes up? Mewtwo does. Because if that shows up, we'll blast it. I do have Banana Master, so we'll blast that too. But then he'll blast Banana Master, and then I have to recycle Banana Master, and it gets a little bit troublesome. But I need prize cards quickly, so... Okay, energy comes back. That's free retreat energy using my stadium. Ninetales is probably going to come out and start, you know, blasting the Mew. It doesn't have that much energy, so maybe this will come out instead, in which I'll take that card. Now it's the big one. Okay, big one, little one. We can deal with it then. If it was a bunch of Lola Ninetales, then I'd be... Oh, man, that's that's lame. That's lame, but uh, this one, that'll be okay. So GXing both... Okay, if I GX this, he can't trade. If I GX this, then uh, that's more more of a dangerous attacker right there. Hello, Big Woodster. What a Kingdom Hearts remix you have. You'll heal them pretty soon. It's okay to have a tweaked status, for surely. The all serious question, do I have regular status? Seriously? I will check. I gotta focus on the match. I'm gonna lose. Uh, let me t let me. I'll do it on the side. So he's played Shana. Checking Nightbot Slog. You don't, full pie. You don't. If you have, if you're a subscriber, you don't need it either. But you don't, full pie. That's a serious answer. All right, Barry Master. There's only one Alola Nine Tails that could be uh, that can we can pierce through, that we have to worry about. We'll Barry Master that. This comes out. All right, so he's like, this is worth it. I don't see too many GX Pokemon's out, so 120 is like he can't afford me to gain too much many more energies. So it takes two prize cards right there. All right, I'm gonna send this out right here. Mewtwo, you got your GX attack. That is totally worth it. I think so. Cosma, go ahead and come out. Full buy has redeemed the regular status. Ooh, I'll get you after that full buy. I gotta focus. So he's saying this is worth it. Side striking this is nothing. All right, I'll take it. Here we go. Side strike GX. Pierces through everything. Resistance doesn't matter. Actually, it does matter. But we had a choice band, so I'll take it. I mean, it's worth it, isn't it? So now we have to play the game where I try to outlast my opponent. Yeah, hopefully these are GXs, not the baby one. Actually, the baby one doesn't do so much because I have... Yeah, I do have one big burst here. Baby Ninetales comes out. We we do have a way to deal with that, but just not now. So I'm going to have to start tanking. Start tanking uh, some stuff. Uh, he doesn't actually have a DC yet. He needs to have a DC, so it's not ready to attack. But I can't do anything right now. Another Barry Master shows up. Probably the one that has the energy. He still does have his GX stack. He could GX attack me. 
No, it's Baby Berry Master. <laughs> hey, Baby Berry Master. That's actually the very first time I said that. Baby Berry Master. Coconut Master. So many masters here. I still have this. I do have Moon Guys meme. Gonna play N. Yeah, I actually have less cards. The, the amount of cards that are useful to me is so so. So so. I kind of wanted to draw a supporter because I actually have a lot of junk. So this may help me out if I draw the nice stuff. I've been sacrificing supporters left and right. Three ends are gone. I don't need ends. I just need secrets. Oh yeah, I need you. You're not gonna come back to me then. Then I'm in trouble. Okay, if I start filling up bench space with this, this is bad. So right now I can't pierce through this. I have the card that pierces through this. All right, he's gonna come up and attack me with this then. That's fine. I have a free retreat. And this, I need a healthy attacker, so it might be this card. So I'll have to fill up my bench space right now. I need another energy. It'll probably be for you if, if I'm desperate, because I can still pop something big. Uh, at least with this guy. We, uh, we're we gonna go ahead and sacrifice. You know, pay that up. I mean, after this is gone, it should be okay. Hey, Lunala. Hi there, buddy. Can you... Can this thing one-shot you? Did I, did I play too much bench space? No, I can just heal up. I'm okay. I'm okay. Let's pop this max potion to be safe. I'm gonna use energy transfer right now. Energy transfer. You have lots of energies on the that. Uh, he might have another baby one. Let's see. Uh, he does enough damage to one shot me. My 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 Lunala. If he's got another baby one and a DCE. So we're gonna take that off just to be safe. We're gonna max potion the only guy who can take it. And we're gonna move uh, move everything back in. Now I need that less bench space for Berry Master because that nine tails is gonna be crazy. Unless you can, you know, get a chain KO, chain Guzmas, that is still possible. That'd be very the most quickest way to victory. Sending that up right there. We're done. Are we done? Yes, we're done. We're done. Be very careful. Okay. So with this, we can. Uh, I think I need a little bit extra damage. It's got resistance on me, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So actually, 120. I need another energy to full burst this guy. I need another energy to full burst. And I'm afraid that he that that card could suddenly randomly show up with another berry master. And can he GX me? Yeah, he can. No, he can't. He needs two two uh two dark energies. So I think I'm safe. Nothing can one shot this right now. I'm done. I'm gonna have to use full burst right now. Take that Zora arc out. And once again, this nine tails is out of here. Now, okay, max potion. Good, 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 good. Kind of regret about having this out. Still, hi, brick wall that I cannot pass through yet. But I'll get you. I'll get you. I'll get you. Energy goes onto this. So this is not attacking, luckily. Very, 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 very good. So we still can use a big prismatic burst on something. Or I can use a double Guzma if I actually have the bench space for it. I don't have the expansion space for it. Go oh, once the baby Cosmog. Oh yeah, please. I need bench space. I need bench space. So buying some time here. I couldn't hurt him. I couldn't hurt him though. I couldn't hurt this. This thing's. This thing's. Yeah. This only the size like pure through it. I already used it to one shot that GX. Beacon. Oh, he's gonna land that card. So let me see what he wants. I actually have enough energies to double, double, double this. Use this attack twice. What do you want? I mean, there's only one card you can play, and that's Barry. That's... Wow, you got the break, too. All right, so... Luckily, we got another Lunala. Okay, in that case, you are now a valuable asset. Let me see. Guzma counts. All three Guzmars are in the deck. It looks like I don't really have to worry about getting this thing charged up. It's just something there. So I'm going to go ahead and play this right now. Let me see what's in my deck. Guzmas, are you guys here? Hey! Hi there! Okay, don't let me down, guys. You guys don't let me down, okay? Okay. 
I think I used it too soon. I used it too soon. I used it too soon. I need to take this first, then use the Guzma. I showed him my I, I showed him my hand pretty soon. So I'll, I, that's that's not my way to victory right now. We're gonna use the minimum amount of energies on this because I don't want anything to happen. That was a waste. I should have waited next turn. Alright, you get the minimum amount of energies. He allowed me the chance to take this out. He should have left that up front instead of... Uh, but he, he wanted more cards. That's what he wanted. To evolve it. Okay, so we're going to use Super Absorption. Take that! And now he knows I've got the winning card in my hand. That, that last... That secret hidden move was just too early. Dealt too early. So he's got to end away my cards. I wasted that potential. And now, it's just waiting for one 20% one chance that the Guzmas are going to come out. I just saw that. I was like, I don't have to take that two prize card this turn. Take the little baby known tails. That opened up when he retreated. Hmm. Okay. Leave me there. Necrozma is cool. Yeah. Yeah. The ability to move energies again and again since Vampire is completely broken. Yeah. Smile. He know he didn't have an end. I don't think he didn't have an end. Yep, I see it. We still see it. Now, finally, baby Ninetales. It should have been up much, much earlier, but I think it's just luck that he couldn't get it out. His DCs were prized up. His DCs were prized up, so he couldn't get it out there. And Mew 2 is holding his ground. And I, there wasn't too many GXs that, you know, was worth it to use the Black Ray, and that I would just one-shot every GX enemy that could come out. So that is that. It hits me a little bit. He didn't have the counter move, so we are going to go ahead and pull... Uh, Nine tails out. I think I have enough energies to take this out. And now I have to move these energies because this is a slow process. I don't want to move that. I don't want to move that. I want to move this. I need how many energies? Okay. You guys are going to kill me if I don't do a big black ray. You guys are going to kill me if I don't take the extra turn to do that. So here we go. That looks like it. Prismatic Burst. Six energy Prismatic Burst. 370 damage. And let's let it be. Let it be. Alright. Good game, Jay Dunn. Welcome to a rematch against Jay Dunn. I think his deck is more, uh, more, you know, quite, quite strong. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, no, we do the rematch, see what happens. I'm going to play my remix of Wooded Kingdom from, this is, S Super Mario Odyssey. Despite having this many cards, every card in my hand is bad. So in that case, I'm going to have to charge, cut this up. I know I'll get this back later, but hopefully we pull some start cards that we need. Yeah, there we go. We need basics. I'll leave you up front. You have resistance, but I don't care about resistance. I mean, if he, there's an energy that goes on here, I'll take it out. This should not be an energy that comes up here. Joyce Man! Okay, he wants to fight me? No, you don't do that. Or maybe you do. I'm gonna KO this. I'm gonna KO this card. It's gonna retreat then. I think he wants to, he'll retreat it. Like, he'll retreat this. The choice, man, like, I, I know you have to... Here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking. Like, uh, you gotta get a new hand. These are all the cards he could play. This is deadly. This is deadly. Okay, Lily. Ooh, eight cards. He, can, he has Bridget, but he's gonna get eight cards to pull out. Eight cards, Lily. Lily is like, I'm the, I'm, yeah. I'm, you should be starting off with me. You should be starting off with Bridget. She's old school. I'm new school. Okay, Zoroark. You're going home, right? He's like, oh, I'm out of here. I'm out. There we go. I knew it. I knew it. He knows what's up. It's like, oh, it's going to fight. No, it's not going to fight. So that was an expensive retreat. So end turn. Can't evolve it. Probably will next turn. Here we go. Here's my free retreat. I suppose I should start attacking because I can. And you know, weakening up a Lele is going to matter sometime, some point. I have to play second war. Bye Lunala, bye Max Potion. You know, when the goal goes to the trash, it feels kind of bad. Alright, Choice Man. Blow this down to I too. You need, the, you need this. Now, he might throw a field removal. 
All right, that's all I can do. We're gonna go ahead and use energy drive. Should be enough to take half its life. Well, it's not. I, that, that's not enough. There's no energies whatsoever. But it is wounded. Even the Necrozma GX will be quite lethal to it if we do get it up. So we're gonna wait, hope to see, hopefully see more GX cards. Even if it's two GXs, that's not the GX one. That is the baby one right there. Baby one's got an energy. He didn't get any DCEs. He had to pay the first DCE up as an emergency retreat. But he knows. He's like, I'm not gonna let you take that Zora for free. That's good. But that's a lot of cards in your hands. And I don't want to fill up a bench space unnecessarily. So I'm going to wait and not play this. I'm going to play Sycamore instead. Which, Sycamore, what are you destroying from me? We need to do Cynthia quite quite, uh, quite, uh, quite immediately right now. He might not stack. That means Full Pie is going to win everything. So, uh, end of the game. End my turn. I could add the energy in that it's to do 90, but that's not enough. So I'm going to put it right here. Let's go ahead and play Sycamore. Goodbye, Guzma. Goodbye, Coconut Master. Oh, oh. All right, so what do I do? I got Ludala up. I can now move energies wherever I like. I don't have another energy, so I, I don't know if I may risk losing this card because if he does something, maybe, maybe not, maybe yes. I could put it on Mewtwo too, so I can get the KO this turn. Oh yeah, you can get the KO this turn. I think that might be worth it. But Mewtwo has to show up right now. We we can do this. It's now losing the energy or not losing the energy. Energies can come back. You got that super rod. You can recycle that back. So let's go ahead and get immediately get the Mewtwo. Don't let this Lele get away. Don't get this Coconut Master out. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and retreat. Send Mewtwo out. Mewtwo, you do it you actually don't do enough damage. Oh yeah, that's wrong. Never mind. I would still need a choice band. Your math is wrong. Unless you want to GX this, Donald. I don't think so. I don't think so. But this looks safe. It doesn't have any weakness to, uh, to anything. We're done. We're going to use full burst. Almost bring it to the brink of death. Almost. 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 You don't have the choice band to Mewtwo. So that was a little bit of wasted action right there. That, that one right there. Alright, so, looking up right here, Nest Ball, so it's true Pokemon, right now there is no main attacker that I'm worried about, last time that we fight, fought, there was Nine Tails, there was uh, that, other stuff, I feel that like I benched out quite significantly now, so, is it enough to get a one shot, I would need, uh, I would need one extra bench Pokemon, so I haven't thrown it down yet, that would be quite deadly, so we, now we just need a max potion, don't have max motion, then we just retreat the Mewtwo, send somebody else to finish this off, finish the job off, and that's gonna be that. So, if we send that, if we send, you know, he's got weakness damage with this card, so I'm a little bit worried to send out somebody that has this. Just a little, just a little. Okay. Berry Master replacing the free retreat to Stadium. I kinda need that stuff. And right, once again, there are just not enough GX Pokemon for me to pop this GX instead. There's a lot of bench Pokemons, but once they become, start becoming GXs, then uh, yeah, I get full value. Stand in! Does a lot of damage. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of damage. So we're gonna have to look for a uh, Super Potion. Alright, this looks like uh, we get some good value. And here we go. We're gonna take away these choices. Now, I think, I'm, I don't know if this is gonna survive. But I'll let him keep the stadium. Is this, this, is this, this arrow's blocking, this arrow's, this thing is blocking me from removing that tool in the back. Thank you, UI. You see that? I can't click the item back there. It's like, you can only remove this, but I'm not going to let you click what's back here. Can I, no, can I not, not do it? Great. Great. Thanks, Pokemon. Thanks. I'll remove the stadium then because I cannot click that choice man back there. Thanks, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm not talking... Ah. <laughs> ah, oh. oh, okay. Just whatever, man. Whatever. Mm, I could throw you down. Yeah, I'm gonna have to evolve a bunch of these anyways. I'm gonna fill up my bench space. This is gonna stink. We're gonna play the max potion right now. And 
Play N. We don't have... We don't have a retreat. We can only have two energies, though. Soul's gotta live. I can't... I don't have anything that has, can one-shot that. Energy goes here. I, I can't risk this. This thing is fixing to go down with the next move. So I have to give him the prize guard. I have to give him the prize guard. I'm gonna have to move back. Move this back here. Move this over, Coconut Master. You can't take all my energies. I give this Mewtwo up. Because I didn't pull the max potion nor a retreat. Uh, I took away two of the stadium, so one stadium is there. So I was like, yeah, value! DC back here. This is the card that's required to get the to, to get the KO. I really needed this to go away. Very, very badly. Because that, that allows them to one-shot Lunala with a full bench. So, yeah. That's what it goes. Okay. Lele one-shots Baby Zora Arc. Yeah, I could have. With two energies? Nah, I need. I, I wouldn't have enough energies for that. He would do 80 damage to do that. So I need a third energy. Five energy. Three energies on this. And I didn't have. Actually, I think I had enough. No, I don't. I only have four energies overall. You see that? I need three energies. Two to retreat, and that. It, it's just to be. I didn't land that max potion in time. Alright, so. Where's your Acerola? I have this stuff. It's in my deck. It's somewhere in my deck right now. Ultra Ball. We're gonna see which Nine Tails comes out. It's Baby Nine Tails. Luckily, somebody can deal with that right now. The card I can is already out. Let's see. He can do up to 150 right now with this. So, uh, preferably another Mewtwo would be the guy who shows up. Banana Master, making sure I cannot harm. Uh, I cannot harm this. Do I got that super odd deck? Yeah, I do. I'm okay. I'm okay. Right is beating. I'm still alive! Yes! You didn't take the free two prize cards? Like, I'll get it later. I'll get it later. Okay. In that case, we know what we need to do. Throw this on. And I'll give you a better hand because I need uh, some more stuff. There we go. Max Potion. Yeah! Yeah, two prize cards. Gotta take that chance away. Alright. Alright, uh, let's see. Retreat. Retreat. Okay. Psychic transfer. Banana Master, he might take you down. I won't be able to che cheese through that right there. So, the value I'm gonna do with, uh, with this is probably big. I could just... You know, I already made my decision. You know, this... I don't have to waste a Guzma for this later if I use the G Black Ray GX. And it should pierce through everything. No, it won't pierce through this. But I do have enough damage to take this out, so it's okay. Black Ray GX. 80 damage to the front, I believe. No, 100. Actually... Oh, it pierces through everything. Oh, everything at all. Cool. Two prize cards. So, I don't have to Guzma that out. I'm good. He won a Banana Master because, hey, you got nothing to go through through this. And we would, one Guzma here, maybe one Guzma somewhere else. And we're good. We're good. Yeah. And right now, this thing only has 110 hit points. It has resistance, so it has 130. So Mewtwo would be able to finish this off. And another evolution, Zora Art Break, able to copy my... Uh-oh, he can copy... He can copy my GX attack for free, but that counts as his only GX attack. So that'll be something more... Uh, something scary. That means everything he hits me with is was, was, was weak enough, so... Uh, I think it's gonna jump in, and he's gonna do that. He's definitely gonna do that. Field blower, take away my my valuable cards. Hey, so roll of juice. We have max potions. We have two max potions. That doesn't. I don't have to use. Actually, I can Skyla that next max potion out if it's in my deck, which I don't know. I don't know if it's in my deck or not. And all right. So he may copy Black Ray, or he may not copy Black Ray. Oh yeah. 
Oh, yeah. So the main Pokemon that comes out is going to be okay. But I lost my retreat. Uh, retreat stuff. That's small. He could just do straight bench damage. He does 160. If he's got a choice ban, he can one-shot this. And I lose a lot of prize cards. He may Black Ray me. Foul play. He's going to copy Black Ray. That's no more GX for you. That's good. Who one shots 140? That's a lot of resistance. 160. I need 160 damage to KO you. 160 damage. It's possible right now, but I can't uh, afford to retreat with this. I have no retreat options, do I? I don't have any retreat options. My stadium is missing. I could force some card pulls. It's possible. I could force a card pull. Maybe I might get that retreat. So here I go. I'm going to use Max Potion because this is the guy who doesn't have weakness damage against those dark Pokemons. I don't need these cards too badly. So I'm going to go ahead and trade them off. I have this guy to pull me more cards. Oh no! I don't have the pre-evolution this time. It's, I have to use rare candies. Pull me a retreat so I can get a much nicer way to do with this. Boo! Don't get that. I do need the energies back though. I'm not sure if I want to get this turn that at least. So I wanted to use a big Mew Mew to attack, but that's not gonna happen. So I may have to prismatic burst. Okay, you're a little. I'm a little worried that you're holding out the energies. Move it here. Mewtwo's the next fighter. Maybe Banana Master, which will eat all my energies up. We're done. We definitely don't want to leave this alive. Prismatic Burst. Wait, how many do I do? I need to do... I do 130 right now. You have 140, unfortunately. I do 130, so that's it. Prismatic Burst. Take that out. You're too dangerous to let live. Stay alive. So one prize card. All right. How many Guzmas do we pay up? How many Guzmas? We have two Guzmas. So we can definitely want that as well as a basic Pokemon. da 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 da, -da. Energy and Lele, no resistance, yeah! Yeah! That's okay. Anybody know how to reset for password? I'm not sure, Scrim. I am not sure. Hello, user undecided! Yep, thank you, thank you, baby, for telling us. I have a full bench, these things are good value. He's not fighting with this. He's like on one ball damage. Yeah! Okay, so. Looking up, N. Oh no! I get less cards, but these aren't the cards I want, so maybe that is a good thing. I'm looking for Guzma right now. Free retreat! Yeah! Skyla, anything I want. All the max potions so far is used up, so I'm not sure what I really want with Skyla. So, right is beating, that goes down. So now, the I believe this is a safe card. I don't have a full bench. You should not be able to take this out. I'm not throwing this down there. I'm not throwing this down there. However, I will Skyla through my deck. I will grab an Ultra Ball to shrink my hand. Better put this on a safe Pokemon. I'm not sure who's a safe Pokemon. Nobody's really safe. You have the most hit points, so... Let me see. I have to deal, deal with resistance damage, don't I? Yeah, I do. You need the full burst with this. Full burst 120. Full burst it. Full burst! What? It's still alive? Oh, I don't have a choice, man. That's it. I thought 120 was enough. No. No, it's not. He's gonna escape with it. Evil Soda. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Goes for the baby. Goes for my baby. So now he has a winning move next. He might have a winning move soon. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble, guys. So if he knocks this, if he has a Guzma, he wins. Oh! And I can't move energies anymore. I cannot move energies. So I'm afraid of the Guzma right now. He's holding too many cards. He's, there's got to be a Guzma. I have to play end this turn. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. Okay, play this right here. 
we've got to Guzma. Otherwise, that's a game. He's, that was good. Okay, so let's go ahead and Ultra Ball right now. Ultra Ball. We need Coconut Master. We have to play N. We have to play N. Oh, I don't have a Coconut Master. Is N even here? Yes, N is here. N is in my deck. So I have to manually draw that. I have to manually draw that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, that's Sycamore. That's not enough. That's not enough. Okay, I have to play this instead. I have to play Sycamore instead of N. Hi, N. Okay, this is where you kind of... Maybe you should have super rod this back in the future. I was like, I'm saving it so I can get full value, but... That's where it would have came in handy. Back in the past when I had that super rod? Hmm. Didn't think about that. Didn't think of the situation would come up. Okay, so with full burst, this does 150. Even with resistance, man! That's lame. I can't move the energies anymore. I cannot move the energies anymore. They're all stuck on this card. Uh, if I retreat, I pay up two energies. So full burst is just too tanky with resistance. His, res his resistance survived me through... Uh, he's, yeah, that's 10 hit points. 10 hit points. Yay. Yay, resistance. I think he has the winning move in uh, the Guzma. GG. GG. Guzma. Yep. Send it out. There we go. Got me in the rematch. Well played. Uh, 70 damage. Yep. Full bench there. You, you, 10 hit point. So hard. You too. Okay. Good game. I'm not. Good game. Good game. I'm satisfied. We dance. We dance. That's good. Okay. <laughs> okay. Leave me Well, looks like you reached the end. Thank you. Congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. So, let's break it down. Lunology X, what is your unique trait? What's the biggest thing about this deck? And that is your psychic transferability to move energies wherever you want. This sort of stuff has always been top tier. Maybe the combo may not be uh, dominant in the meta, but the energies being where they need to be helps you charge Pokemon faster or allow Pokemon to attack that they normally wouldn't. And Max Potion, all that stuff, makes it top tier. 5 out of 5 for that. Uh, damage. We're also going to give it a 5 out of 5. What? You have a one-shot somewhere? Well, kinda if Necrozma's Black Ray goes off. I mean, if he tags all the GX Pokemons, you will one-shot them all right afterwards. Because a lot of your team do have that damage to do that. So we're going to give you... You are capable of 5-5. Five, five. Chain KO GXs. That's what a 5-5 five, a five is. A setup. Stage 2. And you also still need to get a bunch of energies through Mew and stuff. So the combo at the start is a bit complex. You're... Like, oh man, please, I hope I land rare candy and all that. So we're going to... It's not too bad. So I'm going to give it 3.5. Where's this little extra speed coming from? Well, you do have the deck engine. Skyla, rare candies. It is possible to be ready on turn two. Possible. But, yeah, yeah. All right, so that's that. It's still slow because this is stage two defense. We're going to give a little bit extra here. 4.5 out of 5 because I am using max potion. I can heal my hit points back up to full. Extending, pretty much, you know, give me extra prize cards. Now you have to do more damage to me. So that's that's really good right there. Rating. Final, final rating. I'm still going to give it. It's always a 4 out of 5, isn't it? Well, the thing is, I don't like you know, slow decks. And I don't like dragging the game out through this kind of strategy. I want to be able to win quickly. Do tons and tons of damage. Which, you know, it is possible. It has a, both of uh, you know, both worlds still. I prefer a little bit more speedier deck. So right now... I think it may, uh, you know, those faster decks that can do with one energy DCs that can go uh, all out. They have a chance, of, you know, it scares me. It's a chance of not letting me set up. However, once I'm up and going, it's going to be quite solid. Because I'm, I know I'll be able to out-trade through max potions. I have a lot of damage stored across many Pokemon, so it's good. I would mind give actually a little bit higher score, but 4.5 is how I feel right now uh, about that average. Average definitely could take on the meta. So weakness. The weakness of this deck is if you lose your energies, you can't move them anymore. So that sucks. That's the that's the biggest gripe. These sort of stuff. 
Yeah, if they sink the thing that has all the energies, you're in trouble. That's okay. That's okay. We do have ways to make those energies back up quickly. What else? Uh, I got a Karan surprise card too. I think that's it. Upgrades. You know, for the most part, I think this is a decent deck list. If anything, you know, minor tweaks make a difference, so I'd have to play a little bit more. And then we'll see what those minor, very few card changes, I think, are. So, I think that is it. For Lunala GX, what is up for Thursday? Or actually, probably seeing this this morning, if you're seeing it right away, then... For Thursday, we are gonna do Incineroar. Where are ya? Oh yeah, this got upgraded because of that Marowak. And just, just to tell ya... It works a lot better than it has in the past. So, uh, that's gonna be for two... Well, actually, later this afternoon. Because I'm a little bit late today. So, that is it for this video. So, you know, just saying my usual stuff. Totally like, subscribe. Because you know you want to see more videos like this. If you follow me on social media, I'll give you clues when new things are happening. My Discord link is right above my head. And now it's the morning, so, uh... Pretty good number. Uh, remixes can be found on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. If you really like these remixes you hear, there they are. Next video is uh, tomorrow. No, I said it's later. This, it's actually later this afternoon. All right, that is it. So, thank you very much, Integral Differentials. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.